Hey everybody, it's Mariana with Three Peaks Classroom. I am a grade three and grade four teacher here in Alberta, Canada, and I love to make helpful YouTube videos for other teachers just like you. Now I wanna continue with my math game series. In previous videos, I've covered games for place value, addition and subtraction, and I just recently did multiplication and division. And I wanna dive into with, with you into my bin for fractions. Nope, that doesn't say fractions. It says I got it from Dollarama. This is my fractions bin. <laughs> I don't have very many materials in here because I haven't had an opportunity to create more math games. I know there's a plethora of games out there. I just haven't had a chance to go ahead and print some games, but also because the fractions unit in my year plan is quite short. I think I only have it for two or maybe three weeks. And so I feel like there's just not enough time to play a variety of games. And so I'm just gonna dive right in. I have three things in this bucket. The first thing that I have is this fractions bingo game that I have purchased from a garage sale and it's fractions bingo. So basically the students have a game board, they have their pieces and I'm calling it out. They have to understand fractions and equivalents up to 12th, which is perfect for the grade three curriculum um, and grade four right now as well. It's really good practice. So um, yeah, this is, I love these, this uh, brand, by the way, when they, uh, the bingo games that they have. I, I use them all the time in preschool, but I have one as well for um, a multiplication as well. But yeah, I like using the fractions bingo. I love doing bingos on Fridays, by the way. It's just a really simple way to reinforce math concepts that don't require a lot of prep and planning. So fractions bingo, win in for me. All right, if you watched my multiplication and division video, you know that I'm a huge sucker for dominoes. I made my own multiplication dominoes um, game that the kids can play during our math stations. And here I have purchased a fractions domino set. I think I might've purchased this from a teacher's convention maybe, but in this set, it's really small, but it has 45 different fraction dominoes. Um, and the top has an image of the fraction and the bottom has the actual fraction. So here you can play um, the actual way that you play dominoes where you have to match the image to the number or you can have a battle, I guess. You can just choose to do um, the pictures and you guys can do, the kids can do a battle to see whose fraction is larger, whose fraction is smaller, um, yada yada. But there's lots of different ways that you can play fraction dominoes. So this is a must for me in my fractions um, game bin. All right, and the last game that I have, it's only the third game, but the last game that I have is a colored, ooh la la, copy of I Have Who Has Fractions. Uh, and this one is from Easy Peasy Learners on TBT. So thank you very much, Easy Peasy Learners. But here I have all of them and I have them actually labeled and ready to go. So they have the numbers on them, one, two, three, four, five. Um, I hope the kids don't notice that they might notice it after the first turn, but, uh, for me, I have it easy to, easy to read so that I can put them in order and I have them up until 33. So let's, let's pray that I don't have more than 33 students in my class. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, so I have um, the I have who has game. This one is a really quick and obviously we know this is like a whole class. Um, this is a whole class game. I guess you could divide it and you can have if you're playing this in a small group, you can have students watch for multiple fractions. I guess you could do that, uh, but you would have to have like large enough groups um, in order for them so that they don't have like 10 that they're looking at. But anyways, I have who has fractions games fraction dominoes, and I have fractions bingo. Those are all the games that I use in my fractions bin. Obviously, I don't have that many. So if you have a fractions game that you highly recommend, please let me know in the comments below because I'd love to print it or I'd love to buy it and include it in my fractions bin just to uh, change it up because I only have three games. So if you have something that you could recommend, please leave me a comment down below. If you liked this video, also don't forget to give it a thumbs up so other educators can see the video as well. Maybe it'll inspire them to get their own um, math games going. And don't forget to subscribe because every Sunday night, every Sunday, I should say, I like to put out a new video on my YouTube channel talking about anything educational related. So thank you so much for being here. I hope you guys are having a great day. I will see you in the next episode. Bye.